Skiji, one of the largest food markets in the world, where the daily trade amounts to almost $15 million. The best fresh seafood, fruits, and vegetables. You can find every possible ingredient here in Skiji. Today, we focus on sweet potatoes. Japanese sweet potatoes are big, and their skin is a beautiful purple. They're not only sweeter than pumpkins, but also soft and flaky like chestnuts. The Japanese are big fans of sweet potatoes, using them to create a variety of desserts. Traditionally, they are either dried or fried. Recently, sweet potatoes are often used to make breads and pies. Rich in vitamins and fiber, sweet potatoes are a healthy addition to many meals. But that's not all. Sweet potatoes are used to make shochu, a very popular liquor in Japan. It's an ingredient that produces various kind of food and drinks. Finally, there is no Japanese person who can resist yaki imo, baked sweet potatoes. Yaki -imo. Food trucks selling baked sweet potatoes are a staple of Japanese winters, universally beloved by everyone. From kids to adults, these potatoes are a kind of Japanese soul food. In fall, people enjoy digging for sweet potatoes. It's a popular harvest time event held nationwide. Welcome to the interesting world of sweet potatoes, a time-honored ingredient in Japan. Trails to Skiji. Good morning, I'm Juliet. In Japan, autumn is considered the season of flavor. It's the season when a huge variety of different fruits and vegetables all begin to sprout, making it the season of tantalizing, interesting flavors. So today, let's go try find some of those flavors in here. I was born and grew up in Australia. Sweet potatoes remind me of mashed potatoes my mum used to make for me. The vegetable section of Tsukiji Market is filled with seasonal vegetables in the fall. Oh, this looks like an absolutely massive option. I hear some voices coming from a corner of the market. It's an auction carried out with traditional hand signs. The unique motions of the fingers represent different prices. They're trading sweet potatoes. October, November, and December is peak sweet potato season. During this time, about 20 tons of sweet potatoes arrive at the market every day. Wow! This gigantic one weighs almost one kilogram. It has beautiful purple skin. This is top quality Tsukiji sweet potato. Sweet potatoes came to mainland Japan from China via the southern island of Okinawa about 400 years ago. Thanks to selective breeding, there are now as many as 90 types of sweet potatoes in Japan. Here we have 
of all the shops that are in between the options. I heard that there was a wholesaler which specializes in sweet potatoes. So I decided to visit them. Kansutoshi Shimada runs a vegetable wholesaler founded by his grandfather over 50 years ago. He is a sweet potato expert. They look identical. Actually, they are all different types. Purple Sweet Road was developed in 2002. Thanks to its beautiful color, it is often used in baking. Beni Azuma, the most common sweet potato in Japan, is very yellow inside with a soft and flaky texture. Sato Musume is whitish inside with a smooth texture. These two types are the most popular in Japan. Both are very sweet and can be cooked and baked in various recipes. Mr. Shimada taught me how to find very sweet ones. So, which do you think looks better? <laughs> Heavier potatoes are denser, and when they have beautiful purple skin, it means they contain more nutrients, such as vitamins and minerals. Only sweet potatoes contain jalapin, which makes sweet potatoes sweet. By breaking down the starch, jalapin makes sweet potatoes even sweeter. A large potato weighs about one kilogram, usually costing about four U.S. dollars. Customers looking for outstanding sweet potatoes gather in this store. In fall, Fumio Kondo, a cook, comes every morning to purchase sweet potatoes. How does sweet potato tempura taste? I visited Mr. Kondo's restaurant. It is in Ginza next to Tsukiji. Ginza is the most sophisticated area in Tokyo with many luxurious stores and restaurants. Kondo, who has been a chef for 50 years, has built up a reputation as a tempura master. He's even been featured in a French guidebook. Usually sweet potatoes for tempura are sliced five millimeters thick. But Mr. Kondo's sweet potatoes are seven centimeters thick. This is Mr. Kondo's unique invention. He went through a process of trial and error for two years searching for sweet potato tempura that could beat baked sweet potatoes. The key was slowly frying with relatively low temperature oil at 170 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Then he wraps the fried sweet potato in paper for 10 minutes. 
The remaining heat cooks the center. はい。はい。After 40 minutes, it arrives. One serving weighs 400 grams. And here it is, Mr. Kondo's original tempura. Here we go. <laughs> to my surprise, it's not oily at all. The crust is crispy. The inside is hot and soft, yet flaky. And with every bite, it becomes sweeter. This is a meal I could eat over and over without getting tired of it. The sweet potatoes Mr. Kondo purchases in Tsukiji are harvested in a prefecture next to Tokyo called Chiba. I decided to take a visit there. This area is close to Tokyo International Airport. The first thing you see from the aeroplane when you arrive in Japan may be this sweet potato field. Sweet potatoes are originally from Middle and South America. High in vitamins and minerals, sweet potatoes were used as a nutritional staple in Japan, but were not considered particularly delicious. The Japanese made it their quest to turn sweet potatoes into something special. Yashiro Oki is a farmer who has specialized in sweet potatoes for 55 years. Seedlings planted in May are harvested from September to November. This is my first sweet potato digging expedition ever. This is a machine for harvesting sweet potatoes. <laughs> It digs up the sweet potatoes from the ground. The three members of the Orki family harvest three tons, or 15,000 sweet potatoes per day. In the four months leading up to the harvest, just how does one grow sweet potatoes successfully? Mr. Orki discloses the secret. It's all about the manure. Mr. Oki says it takes two years for his blend of horse dung and straw to ferment. This manure is two years old. The other pile is a year old. Let's take a look at the difference a year makes. <laughs> when he filters water through this one-year-old manure, the water is muddy. When we filtrate with this, one year was not enough. That's why the water is muddy. In contrast, water filtered through two-year-old manure is much clearer. 
microbes in the manure turn impurities into nitrogen, phosphoric acid, and potassium, which are essential nutrients for plants. Another key point is the selection of seedlings. When a farmer finds a good seedling, he multiplies the seedlings so that he can harvest quality potatoes consistently. In the first year, they choose the best three seedlings out of 400. They will be the seedlings for the next year. In the second year, they cultivate the top three seedlings from the previous year and raise 400 seedlings. Then they select the top three from the initially selected seedlings. In the third year, they repeat the process and select the top three seedlings again. So, the final seedlings are the very best out of 2.4 million possibilities. The search for quality potatoes is a long and arduous one. After the harvest, farmers do something to make the potatoes even sweeter. He says, I will find the secret underground. It's a big cave, about 10 meters long. Dirt walls surround us. Here, I found sweet potato containers. なんですかここ。どこですか。ここはね、ちょうど昔からの彫刻庫なんですよ。はい。それで、え、気温、気温がね、え、と、13度前後。ずっとですか。はい。え、その温度はどうやってあの、温度管理してるんですか。自然だけ
To pack this mold full, they use 20 potatoes. I try some fresh imo yokan. It has a unique sweetness, different from that of baked sweet potatoes. Its traditional taste has been reproduced for 70 years. Tsukiji information. Food stores aren't the only kind of merchants in Skiji. T-shirts from this store are a popular souvenir among foreign tourists. The most popular design is this. Abura ga notemas. It has plenty of fat. This is a Japanese expression describing rich and tasty ingredients such as sirloin steak. People laugh when it is used for a person. Among various souvenirs, there are many boots in the store. Actually, this is a boot store established in 1910. Boots are a must for people working in a fish market. Here are the boots the workers in Skiji have worn for years. They are ideal for fish market workers. They researched automobile tires and invented a tread pattern with no slipping. Plus, Winter boots are made of wetsuit material for divers. Summer boots are porous, allowing the feet to breathe. The workers switch boots based on the season. They are carefully designed to look cool. <laughs> the boots are a true status symbol for the young men working in Skiji. Though sweet potatoes are a major ingredient for washoku, Japanese cuisine, they are now very popular among Western-style chefs also. Mr. Ryuichi Hamasaki is a chef from Kagoshima in the south of Japan. Kagoshima is well known for its sweet potato production. The sweet potato is a very familiar and special ingredient for him. The first dish is a baked sweet potato arrangement. So it mixes with sauce well. He cuts and breaks the potatoes open. It is served with quail with balsamic vinegar and garlic. <laughs> Baked Beniazuma sweet potato with quail and balsamic vinegar. Garnished with carrot souffle and herbs, the sweet potatoes share equal billing with the meat as the main dish. 
それにですねあのうずらのちょっと香ばしさ、はい、でバルサミコで少し酸味が補ってあるので、はい、Sweet potatoes and quail Aren't they too strong to harmonize with each other? ちょっと食べやすい、ね、癖もなく美味しいでしょバルサミコとこのさつまいもまたすごくいい感じでねいいはい、はい、The sweetness of the sweet potatoes gives richness to the quail この食材自体がすごく甘みを持ってるから、はい、ちょっと酸味を補うとか、はい、違う塩分を足すとかそういうものでやっぱり違うさつまいもの魅力が出てくるかもしれないですよね。The next dish adapts to the flexible characteristics of the sweet potato. Pureed sweet potatoes are mixed with milk and seafood soup stock. Grilled seafood is served alongside. Pureed sweet potato and seafood harmony. Dietary fibers of the sweet potatoes remain in the pureed version. Seafood and sweet potatoes, an almost unimaginable combination. It's <laughs> <laughs> 全く違うものの味もしますね。It's mellow flavor perfectly matches with seafood. この独特のこのやっぱり深い甘みが魚介に合うんでしょうかね。生クリームをいっぱい足してバターを足してとはまたちょっと違う。はいはい、あのその分をさつまいもが補ってくれてるか。はい I didn't think of it in my wildest dreams, and every dish that I keep eating, I just realize that there's so many different ways that you can use sweet potato, and it's delicious in all these different forms. So, today's been very, a lot of interesting things have come out today. Sweet potatoes, it seems like. Sweet potatoes are a very mysterious ingredient. They become delicious simply when baked. But are also good at bringing out the flavor of other foods. How can we enjoy sweet potatoes even more? Without doubt, people will keep developing new ways to enjoy them. In Skiji, every ingredient has its own story. <laughs>